Hello everyone, Leslie Ann here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel or if you are welcome to my channel, then hello, it's lovely to meet you. Today I've been shopping, so I have actually got out today with Chris, that's my husband. Um, we went and did some grocery shopping, but I needed things from this shop, that shop, and you know what it's like when you prefer things from different shops. So we've actually done a little bit of a collective shop we went to asda for certain things uh we went to aldi for certain things then we went on to jolly's the pet shop um and then we popped into marks and spencers so i'll turn the camera around to show exactly what we have got we are still in absolute chaos because having the new floor done in the lounge everything from the lounge has come out into the kitchen and dining room you can imagine can't you um but it's done and we're starting to put things back today I'll show you what i've got this week for shopping which most of it will last a couple of weeks okay so my mishmash is looking a bit like this and then i've got a few bits there on the store in amongst the chaos and then i've got water over there i might as well start with the water right the water then guys came from aldi and it was one pound 79 per pack we've got two packs over there this lot here came from aldi's so i will go through the prices with you um the eggs i've got um a dozen large free range eggs they were two pound 65 so 265 for the eggs uh, two packs of paracetamol at 39p each. Uh, their own brand of like the Lynx Africa dupe was 85p per can. And uh, so Luke and Chris reassure me it smells exactly the same as the Africa and works as well. Uh, the cucumber was 59p on their sort of... Um, you know, their special six of the week. Uh, crushed chilies was 65p. Garlic was 95p. It was 149 for these three large onions. Uh, 59p for the tomato puree. Uh, these coffee sachets here, they were 95p a box. Um, so I've just got like a frothy latte, vanilla latte and a caramel latte. So they were 95p per box. Absolute bargain. Uh, 52p for the garlic granules and uh, 55p for the oregano. Uh, these were 89p, the sandwich thins. So they're the high protein ones. Um, I did get two packs of cheddar. These were four ninety nine each, um, and it is the mature cheddar. You've got, I think, there's a fair old size here, isn't it? About nine hundred grams, yeah, nine hundred grams each for four ninety nine. And so one of them I'm gonna obviously just keep like a big chunk of cheese. The other one I'm gonna grate up and put it into a sandwich bag so that if you want any grated cheese on anything, just grab some and you know save a bit of time, right? Uh, 55p for the mixed herbs mustard was 65p i think let me just double check i'm sure i saw that at 65 yeah 65 uh cottage cheese this was 79p for this tub of cottage cheese uh one pound 29 for the uh, purple sprouting broccoli uh, baby corn was 125 uh, these were 89p, so I thought I'd get these for Luke to see if he likes these as, he much, as much as he does Doritos. And they were uh, they were 89p. And then these, this um, pack, multi-pack of like different flavours. So you've got on onion rings, cheese puffs, salt and vinegar sticks, and bacon mashes. And you've got 20. 24 pack, 24 packs in there. Uh, 
and they were £2.59 bargain. Um, where do I get this from? A gammon, so a, a large smoked gammon from Aldi's. That was £6.69. Got the uh, up to date book to have a look at. Um, sausages, so I've got a pack of the specially selected 100% British pork sausages. They were £2.49. Then I picked up some of the diced beef. You've got 700 grams here. Uh, it was £6.49. Um, I did get a candle. It smells beautiful. An essential oil, blackberry and mint scented candle. So I've got that for the lounge. Uh, that was £2.99. And then I think finally from Aldi's, it was the uh, specially selected handmade Stratford blue cheese, £2.49. So what you see sort of here, that's all the Aldi bits and bobs. Focus. Right, I'm going to finish my coffee and then I'll move on to Asda. Right, guys, I'm balancing you in the cupboard. Right, I've got the Asda receipt here. Um, so, let's have a look. No particular order, really. Uh, the bleach, 90p. So, I've got some bleach for 90p. Um, that's the extra thick one. Um, kitchen roll, two of those. They were a pound each. And that's the, uh, the Nikki ones. There we go, so I've got two of these. The Nikki kitchen rolls. Right. Um, for the Airwick uh, automatic thing, you know. Um, these were six pounds. So it was two for six pounds. So I've gone for the uh, Spring Breeze and Island Vanilla. So limited edition, apparently, with essential oils. Um, so I got that. That was six pounds. Um, $1.99. This air freshener for the bathroom. It's a new one. I haven't seen this one before. I don't know if you've been into it as lately or seen it online, but they've got a whole new range out. Uh, this isn't part of it, but they've got a whole new range of like cleaning products and shampoos and everything. I've yet to try. I have. I just don't need them right now. But this is one ninety nine, and this is Peony. So it's Blast Can Air Freshener. And it's got that sort of little nozzle look. So let's give it a little, see, blast. Ooh. It was a quick blast, wasn't it? It doesn't go on and on and on. And that smells delightful. That's for the bathroom, mm, that's good. Very nice. Um, okay. okay, 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 okay. Brown sauce, HP, two pounds. So a big one of HP, uh, six, eight, five grams, two pounds. Foil, um, foil was 320 because I got the extra strong one. To me, it's a waste of money having the ones that aren't extra strong because they ju it just breaks. So I tend to get these and it lasts forever. Um, so that was whatever it was I said, 320. Um, we needed some Velcro hooks, some command strips. They were three pound a pack, so we've got two of those. Uh, washing up liquid, I needed three pounds. Um, for Fairy, it's a great big one. It's the Fairy Clean and Fresh Apple and Rhubarb. Mm. Uh, 1,015 mils in that one, three quid. I thought I was. You know, jolly good. Four pounds for these Andrex wipes, the classic clean washlets. Four pounds for four, I think. So four, yeah, for four. One pound seventy-five for each of these for Luke. They are just like if he wants a quick snack or something. Um, and they are the, the, the Gourmet Spicer Shin Noodles. 
and they are, as I say, they are the spicy ones, they're the ones that he likes, 175, and they're the big tubs, so when he's had like the smaller ones, he was like, oh, I could eat two of those, but he has one of these, he's quite satisfied, and it's cheaper than buying two at a time, you know, you know what I mean. Uh, dog tree is 5.95 and 5.95. Um, so we've got the chicken with rice sticks. They're the big pack. So this is the big pack here, 220 grams, 5.95. Still the cheapest place I have seen these out of all of the supermarkets. Uh, no raw hide whatsoever. And again, for the same price, these are the crunchy chicken and calcium bones, but um, it's cornstarch, there's no raw hide or anything. 5 95 again for the same size. Uh, these were three pounds each. These were a little bit extravagant, I suppose. However, sometimes you need something quick, right? Especially when you're working in chaos like we are at the moment. So they only had two of these left. So I've got two of these and one of a different type. So these were three pounds and it is a meal. Singapore style noodles. And inside, it looks really nice. So you've got your Singapore noodles at the bottom. You've got your chicken, you've got prawns. It's like a nice portion. So we'll probably have those tonight, actually. Two of those. Um, one of these, Luke said they'd have this one, which is the chicken pad thai noodles. So same sort of scenario, just a different flavor. I'm getting there, guys. Uh, do -do. Right. I've um, got, some, got some rolls. So these are four large seeded rolls. They were a pound. Liver for the dogs. That was £1.79, if I can find it. Right, so this is some um, uh, chicken livers that I'll cook up for the dogs. £1.79. Four pounds for for these. You've got one point four kilograms of hot and spicy chicken wings. So I thought they'd be nice to put together for you know either a few for a snack or lunches or dinner or main meals, whatever. But I shall probably split them up into different bags and put them in the freezer. These were two for eight pounds, so you've got eight loin pork loin steaks. So I've got two packs of those that say they were two for eight pounds. Uh, these were two pounds seventy each, so you've got three steaks here. We've had we have these, well, mostly when we buy steaks now, I tend to buy these. They are so lovely and lean every single time. Um, so I've got three of those, two seventy each. Uh, butter, picked up two packs of butter at 189, a salted butter, there's two of those somewhere. Uh, it was 295 for a pack of the Laughing Cow light cheese triangles. I've uh, got some pineapple, that was two, two pounds. Yeah, pineapple was two pounds. So this is already, this is a fresh one and it's already been chunked up. And there's 400 grams in there. Uh, I've got two packs of bacon. This is the smoked bacon, 10 slices in here. And uh, two for four pounds. So I've got two of those. There's the other butter guys there. Grapes were, it was like on a mix and match. So you could get any two for two pounds. So I got the green and the black grapes, seedless grapes. Mushrooms were 129 for 400 grams of mushrooms, 129. Um, got some pasta. This was £2.25 and it's spinach and ricotta tortelloni. One of those. Tomatoes, these little tomatoes, so these are the sweet and fruity baby plum tomatoes, they were a pound. You've got uh, 325 grams there. Um, cold cooked meats, 
four seventy five for a big pack. Got three hundred and twenty grams of um, the carved silver side beef. So that's three uh, four seventy five, and then four hundred grams of the oak smoked dry cured ham. That was four pounds. And then I've got two birthday cards, which obviously I can't show you because they might be seen for, you know, who they're meant for. Um, so give me a sec and I'll be back with Jollies and m &S. Right then, my love, it's Marks and Spencers. Um, I wanted some hot horse radish and currently it's the only place I can find it right now. Um, so that was £2.50 for the hot horse radish. Um, the mint, m and mint sauce was pound thirty for the mint sauce. The Japanese style dark soy sauce was pound twenty. Liam Perrin's Worcester sauce was pound seventy. Um, you got these, which is the m and giant corn um so they've you know they're absolutely lovely and uh yeah gently roasted and lightly sorted okay they do look a little bit like teeth <laughs> but they are very delicious i guarantee you they were uh, they were one pound fifty um got some more stilton the other stilton that i've got in the other shop from i think asda is for a broccoli and stilton soup to make this is to go with these lovely crackers um and it's like a little bit more decadent you know so this is like a rich and creamy stilton this one was three pound fifty and then these beautiful beautiful crackers look at those oven baked cheese and pumpkin cedar crisp breads they were two pound forty so that's what i got in m s literally three things uh 3.99 i know it was 3.99 for these little training pads um i'd like to have been able to get a pack of 100 but this is all they had so i've got those they were 3.99 and then each of these were 5.99 they are really thoroughly enjoying this food right now they don't waste a thing so you've got pure white ball pure wild boar pate pure salmon pate and a chicken pate you would think it's all kind of soft and squidgy it actually isn't it's very firm and we kind of use i would say say this much here from there to there maybe yeah um that does one meal for our two dogs with some of their little biscuits on the top so we just chop it into tiny little pieces and they absolutely love it and now to do the worst thing put it all away i hate that job oh especially when i'm living in chaos it's like i don't have any surfaces free but um we'll get there anyway but yeah i'll just do it gradually get things away and um uh, shopping down for another fortnight other than uh, you know like bits and pieces like fresh stuff i might need or you know fruit salad veggies let's say all the fresh sort of stuff really um but yeah that's it my lovelies i hope you've enjoyed watching this shopping haul i hope you're as nosy as i am i absolutely love watching shopping hauls you know they give me loads of ideas and give me an idea of prices and i love to know what people are cooking as well um but if you have enjoyed it don't forget to give my channel a thumbs up that would mean so much to me and um youtube take great notice if people leave a thumbs up you know or a like and if they comment and of course if you were to subscribe that would mean an awful lot as well but uh, i will see you in the next video until then my lovelies take care won't you bye bye bye